Despite the hiccup with the media, Iowa Republican leaders are telling KIMT News 3 they're happy with how this year's caucus turned out. KIMT News 3's Max Haslow spoke with party members and caucus workers about the kickoff to the 2024 presidential primary season. Max, you were on the ground in Mason City covering this for us. How did the reported crowd numbers stack up against what you saw? Yeah, well, just like you said, Jess, when I was in Mason City, everybody that I spoke with there and today told me crowds were around the same size or even bigger than in 2016 when Trump was first running for president. And after seeing them for myself, I would have to agree. And hundreds of voters were in line at caucus meetings in spots like Clear Lake and Mason City, and Worth County reportedly had around 250 Republican members out to caucus. And this is all despite record low temperatures and wind chills. And Worth County GOP Chair Jeff Gerbel tells me there were very few delays despite large attendance. However, he is looking at making improvements for the next caucus. We'll have one stack of voter rolls for each precinct with the exception of our largest uh, voter precinct. We break that in into a couple of different ones so that we can get multiple people signing into a precinct at the same time. Um, so we might break that out a little bit in the future. Now, Gerbel also tells me he saw several first-time caucusers come out to support Trump last night. And that's a trend I also noticed in several other North Iowa cities as well. Thank you, Max. Presidential candidates will be switching the focus to New Hampshire. The state's first-in-the-nation primary will take place on January 23rd.